Hello everyone, welcome in today's video. So kids, I hope you all are enjoying at your home. So today what we are going to learn? Today we are going to listen a story because today is story time. So today we will learn a story that is about the caterpillar who turns into a butterfly. So today we will learn something new through the story. So today our main character of story is this cute little caterpillar. But this caterpillar is very sad. You know why he is very sad? Because when he was walking into the grass, he saw his color is green. And he don't like his green color because uh, whenever he walks into the grass, anybody can't see him. So the roly poly, roly poly, catch a pillar, walking into grass. And he was very sad because of his color green and he don't like when someone saws him and he say, uh, they say uh, their color is green. When, when caterpillar is walking into grass then he meets a cute little ladybug. And what the ladybug tells to him? Ladybug teases him. Ladybug says Oh, caterpillar, look at you. You are so boring. You are at green. And look at me, my colors. I have a beautiful red coat with black dots. You are so ugly. Look how beautiful I am. And ladybug went. So, caterpillar again got very sad. Roly poly, caterpillar walking into grass and moving into the grass then he made a honeybee yes the beautiful honeybee and you know what honeybee tell him honeybee tell oh caterpillar why are you looking so sad today caterpillar says Oh, I'm sad because of my color. Look at you. How beautiful you are. You have beautiful wings, a beautiful yellow and black color. And look at me. Whenever I walk into grass, uh, someone teases me. Someone, uh, I just crushed into someone's leg. So I don't like my color green. B said him to not to worry. But he was sad. So B just walked away. Now he is walking into grass and while walking into grass he met another cute animal and that is a beautiful snail and snail also tell him to not to be sad but you know what caterpillar says as always I don't know. I'm sad because of my color and my color is green. The same as the color of grass. That's why I don't like my color. And caterpillar walk away from the grass. The snail, what he do? He don't understand anything. While walking, he meets one another cute animal. And that is that cute little squirrel who was eating uh, his food. And squirrel also tell him, hey caterpillar, why are you sad? Caterpillar tell her the same reason. Then what squirrel said to her, him? Squirrel said, hey dear, your color is given by the God. So why are you sad? There is nothing to worry about. But the caterpillar moved away because he was not going to listen everyone, anyone. Now caterpillar goes into his home and he himself uh, packs himself in his cocoon. And he was now in his cocoon. He wrapped himself in his cocoon and now he was resting in his cocoon. It was one day, two day, three day. Caterpillar still was in cocoons. After 21 days, caterpillar finds too boring to live in cocoon. So he tried 
to uh, stretch him out and comes out of his cocoon so what could caterpillar do he stretch himself he stretches high himself and when he comes out of his cocoon he don't know that he had turned into a beautiful butterfly he has not any idea about that and when he was walking into grass he all friends the snail the squirrel the bee and the ladybird saw him and they were surprised and they were told caterpillar hey caterpillar look at you now you are not at all very boring the green color now you have also very beautiful colors so now the sad caterpillar is very happy and how a sad caterpillar turns into the beautiful butterfly that is a story of the caterpillar who turns into butterfly so what we learn from this caterpillar we must not to be sad at every situation we have our own beauty we have our own uh, our criteria of doing something and we are good at we are thank you